the book is all about essentially learning and knowledge and trying to flip reverse sort of traditional stereotypes basically I found throughout my PPT years often I'd ask kids what do you want to do when you grow up and they'd say be famous but they didn't know what for someone that finds you know an amazing life changing advance isn't a household name whereas someone that goes on a reality show can be and it's you know as children we're a blank canvas we're shaping we're forming and we only become what society sort of molds us into we are learning as children whereas as adults we have preconceived notions we're already cynical and jaded we've shaped by the time we're in our 20s by the time we're in our 30s we need years of therapy to undo the process whereas children they only know what we tell them if we tell them the right messages then no matter where they go if they're the president of the USA or if they're the head of a FTSE 100 company, hopefully they'll have the right core values to make them want to give back to society and to derive happiness from doing good for other people as opposed to thinking happiness just comes from helping yourself. I think it's very good, uh, often the break from um, the intensity of being a patient on the ward or maybe being with their family and their sick child um, and also just to promote uh, science and technology and medical careers for uh, children and particularly young girls. I like science and I like that there's like a children's book that's easy to understand about what I want to learn about. I like the quiz a lot. It was fun just answering all the questions. Every three weeks I have to come for a blood transfusion and blood test because I have a rare condition called diamond black fan anemia. It means that I can't make my own red blood cells and I need transfusions to eat. When I'm at the hospital, it's a bit boring just being stuck in a bed. And when I'm out, um, it's nice to do all those fun things I can do. I've always wanted to be a doctor and I just like helping people and looking after them and I like the science aspect of making new medicines and I've been in the same position as my future patients could be in and I think it, make, it helps you understand a lot more how they're feeling if you've been in that position yourself. They, they have in their hearts of a fire that I think grown-ups don't have in that they think I can make a difference and I can make that happen.